The women's 87 kilo class and a quality lineup meant the field was wide open. We joined the competition at a vital stage in determining the medals for the snatch, with three lifters remaining. So right now, Kim Unju is third. She'd move into the lead with a success right here. Oh! That's too bad. Before she was close with that. Yeah. Guaranteed the bronze medal in the snatch. I mean, it was there. It was there. You got to hold it. Uh. And now Al Hui of China, 117 kilos, owner of the last attempt of this snatch competition in the women's 87 kilo category. She makes it, she wins. If she misses, she's silver. Oh, I mean, just beautiful lift. She looks good for even more. It's like she's still warming up. <laughs> well. She is the gold medalist in the snatch competition here at 87 kilos with this 117 kilo third attempt. Casually done, too. Had to make it, did make it, and she's the winner. So the results of the snatch and that failed third lift by DPR Korea's Kim Eunju left her in bronze position and trailing by six kilos from her Chinese rival Oh Wei going into the clean and jerk. We rejoin the competition deep into the second session in a tight medal contest. So now a real tough spot for Kuzmeri Santana. Must make this to post a total. If she's successful, she will move into the lead in the total, but not the clean and jerk. Oh, boy. Come on, she's got a brace here. Yes, hold it, hold it. And comes through and delivers a gutsy yeah. effort. Yeah, that will work. 254 total. And the clean was tough. Yeah. Yeah, she had to fight. But she doesn't buckle on the dip. Yeah, totally different lift. Smooth, yes. Six kilo jump for Al Hui of China. If successful, she would have a 265 kilo total. Wow. You know, I had to work in the clean just a tiny bit, and then the, the jerk was a nap. I mean, just walking so through it. Here's where you can get. And, and let's take a look at this again. 150 is what Kim Eunju is going to stick with, so you know she needs 155 right now to move ahead of Al Hui. She is looking, I guess, Sean, to play it out on the third attempt. Yeah, she is. That, that's what she's going to have to do. Wow, beautiful. Keeps it interesting. She shows why she held that record. Yeah, I mean, very natural. They could go three kilos here. It looks like that's what they're going to do here. They're going to stick with this 151. I think that's the right call. It's a good one, and it would give her a 268 kilo total if successful. And then Kim on June would have to go eight kilos up. Yep. Yeah. Right, she ass. Oh, <laughs> six Man. for six. She has looked fantastic. 151, all 268 kilo total, and she's going to have to sit back and wait. Look at this fan. You know, it's worth noting she's just one year out of being a junior. A wonderful showing here in her first ever World Championships. She's going home with some hardware. They're not going for it. Oh, she's just going for the clean and jerk. Clean and jerk gold. So this will be the final clean and jerk attempt of this competition. 
152 kilos, Kim Unju. Nice job. Wow. Yeah, really well done. So she and goes That was home. a limit to lift today, all right? Yeah. But as it is, good lift, two to one decision. Gold medal in the clean and jerk. Silver in the total, bronze in the snatch for her. Can't be too disappointed. And showing again, just real mastery of this lift. So here are our results in the clean and jerk competition, the women's 87 kilo category. Perfection for our three medalists in the clean and jerk. And then the total, we were hoping maybe Kim Unju would take a crack at a at a third attempt that might have gotten her up to 269, but not to be. She was settled for a gold in the clean and jerk, which is still quite an accomplishment. With 20 men's and women's body weight categories in the championships this year, there were plenty of outstanding results. In the women's 59 kilo category, five lifters shared the medals, three of which went to Kyo Sing Chun of Chinese Taipei. The two-time world champion successfully lifted 105 kilos in the snatch to take gold, but had to settle for the silver in the clean and jerk, as China's Chen Guai Ming didn't only overtake her with the second lift, but also claimed a new 133 kilo world record. Standing overall third on the podium was Latvia's Rebecca Koha. It was a dominant performance by one of the best female lifters of all time, China's Den Wei, in the 64 kilo class. She topped the podium with a sizable 13 kilo advantage to set a trio of world records and seal her fourth world championship title. In the 71 kilo class, it was a familiar story, with China reigning supreme. Zhang Wangli taking all three gold medals and setting two world records to boot. But it wasn't only China's women doing well. In the men's 67 kilo class, it was a Chinese one too, with 2013 and 2015 world champion Chen Li Jun taking silver in the snatch behind compatriot Huang Min Hao, beating him by just two kilos with a 152 kilo lift, only for Chen to then secure the gold medal overall by lifting a winning 182 kilo clean and jerk to secure a 332 kilogram total score. And in the 73 kilo competition, another Chinese lifter triumphed. Olympic and world champion Shi Ziyong won three gold medals to record a 360 kilo world record total. The silver went to the Republic of Korea's Wong Jion Sik, and Vadim Likered of Belarus took the bronze. The heavyweight competitions are always a highlight, and the men's 109 kilogram event featured a star studded field. None more so than reigning Olympic champion at 105 kilos, Uzbekistan's Ruslan Nuridinov. But in a shock result, Nuridinov failed to record a clear lift in the snatch. Leading the way, however, was China's Yang Jua, recording a 196 kilo third lift, closely followed by youth world record holder, Armenia's 21-year-old Sivon Matuliasan. We join the action with Yang about to take his third lift in the clean and jerk at 223 kilograms. Boy, it's I can't get over that arm. Beautiful. Yeah. Sure. And that's going to close off a six for six performance. Good for Yang Zhu. And with that, give him a 419 kilo total. You see Simon Matirosian. Now remember, this is the lightest weight he right. could open with. Yeah. This will be the, the, the new world record in the total. Looks pretty easy at 230. It's crazy. Well, and there we have it. There is our 
2018 national champion, barring well, something no totally crazy. <laughs> So a new world record in both the clean and jerk and total for Simon Monorosian of Armenia. This is great. <laughs> Holy smokes. Wow. <laughs> Man. That's an impressive way to move. 240 kilos. Think he's going to do another one? Maybe 250. Let's go. It has the feel of the end, even though he has another attempt. It doesn't even look like it's gotten heavier. And that jerk, especially. Nice little dip, and boom, weight is right overhead. He has indeed passed his third attempt. Here are our results in the clean and jerk competition, the men's 109 kilo category. And if you look there on the board now, granted our two leaders, one of which who set a world record, uh, passed their third attempt. There are the results in the total for the men's 109 kilogram category. Martiros Jan of Armenia in commanding fashion, 435 total, world record total. Yongju in second, Mihalski in third. So an incredible men's competition with Simon Martiriasan truly coming of age in dramatic fashion. The super heavyweights are up next.